There was no boardroom. That's number one. The boardroom was in Donald's head. The boardroom was all of this idea, these ideas he had, the vision he had. And if you could buy into his vision and you were trustworthy and you were intelligent and you were proactive, proactive was the key. So describe the climate of the late 70s. I mean, the glass ceiling was about, if the ceiling today is, my ceiling is 22 feet high in my home, and the ceiling then could have been two feet high. Every once in a while in your lifetime, there comes a person or an opportunity, or a person with an opportunity. You know, and I'm a woman, I mean, and women don't have these opportunities very often. Before the hit TV show Apprentice, Sunshine played a role in the real life version. How is he as a boss? Uh, or he was never a boss. That's how, the how, truth. Would you, how would you? He was never a boss. He was a leader. There, it's a lot different to have a boss than a leader. He was a leader. He taught me. He mentored me. He showed me the way. That's it, I was like smitten. See, Donald doesn't distinguish between women and men. He distinguishes, he looks for talent. He looks for trustworthy talent. Trump, T means trustworthy talent. Just think about it that way. After 16 years at the Trump Organization, Sunshine branched off, blazing her own trail in real estate development through her own company, the Sunshine Group, all the while continuing close relations with Trump. She says he remains a part of her daily life throughout her Miami home, reminders of Trump's impact, and regular phone calls. When's the last time you spoke with him? Uh, yesterday. And what was that conversation like? It was a very simple conversation. He said he missed me. <laughs> he doesn't have a lot of time these days. When you see him as the front runner, the presumptive Republican nominee, and you see the way he has led his campaign, is that the same way he has led his business all of these years? Do you see the same Donald Trump? I see the same Donald Trump, but I'm not sure that the way he has led his business, which has been entirely successful, works in politics because I think sometimes he forgets what the politic thing is to say. And of course, that's what politics is all about. And I think he just marches, he has continued to march to the tune of his own drummer.